All right. Here I am presenting to you the latest software update for the Nokia 8110 4G, which just rolled out a few days ago. The new software version right now, as you can see, is 11.00.17.0G and is about 21 megabyte update. And this update basically brings a lot of the features that HMD Global initially promised to bring when the Nokia 8110 were first unveiled back in MWC 2013. So this new update basically just installs a bunch of new Google apps such as YouTube, Assistant, Google itself, as well as Maps. We'll go through each one of them one by one. And furthermore, as, what, as far as I can tell, the App Store no longer requires the SIM card to be inserted in order to access it, which is a good thing in my opinion. The App Store unfortunately has no update of any app since I last visited it before this OS update. Right, so let's take a look at YouTube first. <clears throat> Ooh, nice. Hey guys, let's take a peek into Apple's future. There's been a crazy new report regarding the new iPhones and what Apple's going to be doing. All right. Seems like unfortunately this is nothing really more than just the YouTube mobile apps sites, progressive web apps optimized for the 8110 screen, I guess. So then, that might explain why the, the OS update was so small in the first place. So let's take a look at Google Assistant. Well, I don't think anyone is going to bother to read the terms of service or the privacy policy anyway. So let's just go ahead and use it. Allow. Allow. Hello, what can you do? answers to life's big and small questions. What can I help you with? Oops. So this is what it can really do. I assume that it's a basic, basically a very shipped down version of what Google has is on an actual Android phone. Okay, let's, let's start asking this question. Set an alarm for 5 a.m. tomorrow. Well, that proves my point that this Google Assistant is just a very cheap down version of what you can do on the Android phone. So let's see the next app, which is Google. Oh, it's just another shortcut to the Google web website itself. Next, Google Maps. So I think that this what this Google activity is all about is actually it's just simply the <coughs> progressive web app that web version of Google Maps that can be found easily on any web browser once you try to access it. So that explains why the file size is quite small in the, in the first place. So nonetheless, I think that this is this is at least HND is doing something to promise its users what they might ex expect out of this 8110 4G. So if you can, if you want to make sure that you have the update itself, this is how you do it. Go to settings. Select device information from here. Software update. And then it should check it for you. And hopefully you get the update as, as I did. So thank you for your patronage of this video and I'll see you in the next one. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe too if you can. Bye!